Welcome everybody to the uh, Challenge Master episode 21. We will be taking on the Fortnite today's episode. I'm Middlebro, and today's challenge is uh, to take down uh, two dogs. And uh, the potential reward is going to be pistol parts. And the penalty is uh, if I fail this, I cannot use 9mm, which means don't use the submachine gun for the next episode. And because it is a Horde Knight, I will be giving myself the extended time because, you know, Horde Knight runs into the next day, so. I've been gathering iron over the past, uh, overnight, you know, being really careful of zombies because I didn't want to, uh, shoot hitting guns at all. <laughs> you know, being very careful and, but yeah, I've been <laughs> just gathering lots of iron here and, it's gone over smoothly for the most part. I um, got old uh, Psycho Steve hanging out in the morning here. Good to see you, buddy. How we doing? Must be waking up from the uh, morning sleepiness. Eh, no big deal. Nothing on you. Yeah. Also, do you want to wrench some? cars down for engines, I do want to see if I can, if I can do want to build another mini bike just for the sake of uh, rescuing the other one. Let's see here. Let's see what you got for me. You can also use the gasoline. And... Another battery, not... Not too bad, but not what I'm looking for. I'm just gonna do a bit of wrenching and... I'll uh, tune in with you once I've done uh, all that. And I finally got an engine now. A nice quality engine. And, uh... So, happy days. Didn't take that, that, take that long to do. And... I just gotta chop some more wood up for resources and everything like that, you know, just want to make sure I have a good supply of wood because my maple trees aren't ready yet. Two shot these trees now, which is very nice. I don't remember if I mentioned it before in the last episode or not, but I have invested in two level four of Meyer 69er, and just looking at it, see what the last level requirement is for it. Two more levels, and I can finally go to Max 69 now. Then, like, you know, really the only way to damage, like, aside from just maxing all that out is, uh. Maxing all that out is, uh, just up in my tool quality, which I'll do that via combining and stuff, but. Chop a couple more blocks out here for the uh for the steel tools and all this well for the iron so nice being able to two shot these blocks uh, well the stages of the stones and everything it's so helpful and if you have made this far into the video i do want to say uh, if you are not subscribed already and you enjoy my content please do uh, consider subscribing down below it helps the channel a lot and Please, uh, leave a comment, you know, tell me what you think. I appreciate all the feedback uh, that I get. I may not get much of it on my videos, but in terms of comments, but, uh, I'm always uh, looking for, you know, just feedback from you guys. It, it always helps me. And chop this up. Yeah, very nice. Uh, I'll meet you at base here in just a moment once I've got all the stuff loaded into the forge and then we'll plan from there. So I've just loaded all the iron into the forge here and uh, one thing is, uh, you know, I do want to do some extra concrete upgrades uh, for Horde, uh, for Hordeite that starts up, uh, just want to you know, do a little bit extra securement on the supports of the base and 
to make it a 480 concrete iron just uh, cooking away and as I button like I'm putting my stuff my stuff away um we'll just put the engine in there for now and what I'll actually do with these batteries is just combine them real quick have a better quality battery Voila, a little bit of uh, 406 in your life, and and uh, I, on the way back I did check to see what is in the uh, like f the uh, the well bunker ever responded salute, and it did not, but I completely forgot uh, that. And I left uh, the gun safe so full of stuff, and like, oh, I <laughs> I can't believe I left all that sitting there. I did pick up a gas barrel on the way back, so a free 600 gas. Throw that brass car right here in there. And we'll just throw the duct tape in. Yeah, I'm like, so I figured what better way than to... And give, uh, we'll go and, you know, help kill some time before they forward then to, um, you go grab some, go grab all that loot out. It's, you know, I figured it wouldn't hurt. It's like, uh, because I took a quick glance, I think there's like some. I know some handgun, like handgun, hunting rifle, and shotgun parts in there. Maybe point for a magnum. Yes, uh, don't mind the uh, the hole in the house there. I I cut that out intentionally. Uh, it's uh, that's gonna be probably for after when we after rescuing the uh, the old um. Risking the other mini bike and come back to you and raid in that town for for a day. I have a little plan for that. I should also axe these tires up just so I have extras for the just so I have a set of wheels uh ready to go for after horde night. Yep. Not too bad quality. The call of the wheels don't really matter to me. Um, because uh, my other mini bike has a perfect set. Like max out at level 600, but... Apologies for the... the lack of light. Get the torch out real quick. So, got pistol grips and hunting rifle receiver and, uh, and parts and shotgun short barrel. Pistol grip and shotgun receiver, hunting rifle parts, pistol parts, a couple more receivers, and got you know, the grip. Still need shotgun parts to uh, build the uh, build the, the shotgun completely. Um, while we're here, I did want to check out the. Uh, Prison. See if you're. See if this is respawned. Um. No. Not in this part of the prison. Some. Some of the uh, loot can respawn. Like if you're within a certain distance. Um. Got a penny. <laughs> I don't know how you got locked up in here, but I'm not gonna question it. There you go. Thank you for the supplies. Just wanna... No, nothing's respawned in here. Oh wait, there's some parts in here. Um... We'll actually just throw a couple... pieces together to a pistol and then... pull that shotgun receiver out. And I never broke into this one. This shouldn't be too hard to break into, considering you got steel pickaxe now. Break into that, and... 
Let's just take care of a couple of zombies out here. Come here, Psycho Steve. I know you want to go down, buddy. There you go. Don't forget to refine that into gas cans. Um, sounds like there's someone else up here. Hello? Come on, Marla. There you go. Little water to go with. Wash that down. We'll just, uh, yeah, get those painkillers to just help me get some more health back. And. We're, we're looking all right on that. Let's see what's in here. There's shotgun short barrel. Amazing how many of those I'm getting. But, oh well. Um, maple trees are looking good. Is there really much more I can check out? And... Let's actually... I'll actually go and, uh, head back to the base here and... And, uh... I'll formulate a plan, uh, here, uh, it'll probably involve, uh, doing just some upgrades uh, real quick before, uh, you know, midday, just to make sure concrete and can dry and everything. Yeah, you know, just give me a second here. I just did uh, most, uh, all the, uh, reinforced concrete I could do right now, so the one thing I'll... I realize that while building the uh, parts for the mini bike, I do have handlebars, but uh, I need some cotton for the sea of it. Like just raw cotton, not no uh, no um, uh, no cloth fragments, nothing like that. It's like uh, just pure cotton. I decided to come in here and nice little bit of extra leather working. As I was saying, is uh, you know, just to find a bit of that stuff. Pull out the torch and just see what I can find. Like, you know, I wouldn't find another bed in here just to help me find stuff. And short iron pipes, not too much. Let's search that fridge on the way back down. Nice magnum grip. If I had the uh, magnum parts, that'd be lovely. Ooh, nice iron boots. It's like we'll swap those out and then scrap the leather boots down for into their raw form. Just leather. Um, anything in the old iron desk? A pair of cowboy boots and a hoodie. Let's pick up that chair, but looking, I'd say I'm looking pretty good, uh, you know, face down the horde. Anything in the purse? Cornmeal and uh, some rations. Very nice. Turds, which I'll actually keep because, uh, I want to do, uh, some farming. I think there might be a gun safe in here. There is. Let's see what's in here. I just want to bust into it. Won't take too long at all. Already, like, uh, halfway through this junk. I'm hoping for either shotgun no, for shotgun parts, but probably won't give it to me. Uh, nice hunting rifle parts, a full hunting rifle. And uh, more hunting rifle stuff. So. Or the... I could definitely upgrade that hunting rifle, though. Don't eat that camp food. Not bad for a gun safe. Like, usually you just find parts, but sometimes you just find that that uh, that full gun in there. Thinking you, no, nothing in the toilet, and our water. Um. 
We'll just leave that there because I'm right next to the base and I can just drop more stuff off. Corn seed and sham sandwich. I will raid one more house just to be uh, safe on that mini bike seat. It's like I can't find any plants nearby. I don't want to go roaming all the way over to the uh, to the fours just for a just for a piece of cotton. It'd be uh, not exactly the best use of my time. Uh, throw throw the wood in there. Cloth fragments will keep the the raw cotton on me. Um, cornmeal can go in there. I'll just throw the turds in the in the box and just toss all these gun parts in, in here. There we go. Nicely just stir it away. And for you in and I can't remember if I ever raid this house over here, but before I go running off to do that stuff, I want to see if how much, how many more uh, iron bars I can make. I can make another ten, but run low on run awfully low on clay, so just. Uh, He'll start smelting like a thousand clay into the forge. Hope you guys won't mind any longer episode because of the horde. It's like, you know, gonna be a fair amount of action, so... Try to... but all that smelting in will... And, uh, you know, pumping out more iron bars, uh... Let's just go check this place out. Yeah. Anybody home? I know... It was one of the Horde Knights uh, that was uh, tearing this place apart, limb for limb. Our wrench can use that to improve quality. Um, nothing really in here. Let's see. Bookshelves, you got anything for me? Sniper rifle schematic and leather chest armor. Take those points. Another nail gun schematic. What do you know? Charlie got anything? No, not really. Just tear these apart and... Throw that apart and... More... Uh, nitrate. Nothing in there. Oh, here's our cloth bracket. Our cotton. But came to, I came over here if I knew this was in here, but no worries. Might as well finish this off because it's a quick little raid. Even more so, cotton. Very nice. Gotta raid that king size bed. Cupboards. Uh, same old, same old. Nice bit of a nice decent coveralls on the set. And what you got, toilet? Or murky water. I'll take it. There's a there's a third level to this. And egg. Which is break this and and nothing really just aside from trash. And what you got in here? Nada. Uh, hey, at least got all the cotton I need though for uh, for the mini bike seat. Searched you up. Forgot to search you. Gotta search everything. Nice pistol barrel in there and. Scrap you down for wood, and we'll take the shotgun receiver. Awesome, awesome, awesome. I think I basically picked through all this town just for, you know, in terms of raids, and... 
really not much to not much left to do. Um, what I'm gonna do is uh, I'm going to just go and do some resource collecting to kill some time and for the horde, and uh, I'll catch up with you once it's horde time. We're coming up on horde night now, and I'm just doing the last little bit of uh, preps I can do for the night. It's uh, getting close to. The iron bars are, are almost finished off for the base, and there is Fortnite. I'm not really worried about zombies getting up here because they, because I've hit and made the ladders to where they can't get in. I just gotta make sure I don't fall down the ladders, because I do not want to die again. Oh. Here comes the here comes the dogs as I was expecting. Cause I knew last night, like oh, last horde night, uh, dogs were coming. So like uh, they were coming in. So let's just uh, get right uh, right on down to it. I know uh, it's a little dark. So what I'm going to do actually is I'm going to just do that for you and. And let's see here. Just start popping rounds into them. Um, I don't want to dump everything into them, but yo, know, do want to take out these dogs? Wow, I missed that shot on the dog. Come here. Come here, pup. I know you can... I know you want to taste some uh, bullets here. Come on. No, I'm pulling out the SMG for the dog. Try not to blow too much into them here. There's one dog. Man. Come on. Wish you guys would stop being so squirrely all the time. Since you're actually sitting still, I'm just gonna unload a 7.62 into you. Is both the dogs dead? Chris is down. Start, start firing into the crowd here. I think we hit Mikey. There you go, Mikey. Enjoy. I think we took out Marla too, so. Make a little bit more room over here. There, Mikey's gone. Keep giving them their healthy helpings. Nancy, you're next. There you go, sweetie. How does 762 taste? Come on, guys. Get with the program here, please. Get you actually over by the torches. Our Charlie shot. Let's actually take out Chris here. Come on, Chris. Because I don't want to waste any more 7.62s, I think... I, I'm pretty sure I got some feathers going, so... I want some feathers stored up in the box, and I'm just gonna... Make myself a quick little bow here. Um, 
There we go. Um, just throw a couple things in the the old uh, box here. I need some. Just, just whatever works, and give me the wood. Would I? And. Make myself a, a little bit of a bow here. We'll just do like 100, uh, no, like 50 arrows. I want to save the, the, the good ammo for, uh, for tougher, not for tougher enemies, and I should have made some steel arrows. Solera for Charlie. Everybody gets their help helping. There you go, Mikey. Enjoy. Come on. Bob. Come on. I hope Bob ran off. Because he wasn't liking it. Any? Bob came back. Happy to hear. Eventually everyone wants some healthy helping. There you go, Bob. Nice being able to actually shoot through these and not having weird uh, collision arrows. Chris is done. Oh, we got another dog. Come on, guys, get your. Come on over here. I want. I want to try to lose as many of you guys as possible. Try to take out that dog. There you go. Mikey, get your headshot. Oh, hit Charlie. There we go. There's his uh, free headshot. And yeah, while I was prepping, I did pre uh, actually gather, uh, I actually did max out, uh, uh, Fire 69, I got my last couple levels. Another Mikey. Um, let's try and bring him over here. Keep him interested over here, and it's like, uh, if the corpses, uh, Decay and they fall on, and they are actually on another one. They're actually, uh, they actually get, uh, destroyed. And zombies can have some decent loot sometimes. Uh, come on, guys. Last arrow. Ooh, a little head explosion for old Charlie Boy, though. Um, make another. Make another 25 of these so for for the crowd. Come on, guys, get your snacks in. And oh, Penny's joined the party. Good to see you, Penny. I think we just took her out. And he's gone. Their Mikey's ready. And Charlie, I know you love it. Come on. There you go. I'll definitely upgrade this steel arrows or crossbow bolts uh, for you know, for the next uh, for the next time. Wonder if I ever. Uh, 
I wonder if I got crossbow unlocked. I can't remember if I did or not. Got curly one to talk to me. Not anymore. Um, crossbow. Yes, I did. I'll definitely have to make that over. Kind of make that for the uh, for the next uh, for the next time. Maybe even phase out the old bow. Nope. Oh, add arrows. Just burst fire the SMG into the crowds here and uh, just to and just help them out a little bit. Go, Annie. Surely have. There you go. And enjoy yourself, buddy. Um, Chris, one of the Chris's. Do you want? Do you want anything? Come on. I know this is cheesy, it's like I I don't really want to use this base again. Uh, I'm not planning on using this type of base again for uh, for another series uh, other than the series that will come after uh, this one. But that will be uh, revealed in uh, in uh, once the day 35 horde's defeated. Go, come more you down. Yeah, not doing too bad on throwing these guys out. I'm just gonna stop using the SMG and. Um. No, oh, what the heck? We'll we'll make more arrows. They're cheap, and I can get more feathers later on. Just try not to miss, girly. Have we gotten a good amount of good volume of zombies? Come on. Charlie. There you go. Enjoy. Only about 90 minutes left in the horde, and that's ever gonna make it through. It's like zombies don't really do damage, they just kinda stand there. There we go. They're level up too. Come on. Everybody gets all the arrows. Nope, they're one of they're one of loot by a little bit of loot, but eh, not not gonna lose sleep over that one. It's come on, guys. I got plenty of arrows. Uh, I got plenty of his stuff for you guys to uh, munch on. I will admit, though, I do like having these. Uh, these I do kind of like having this uh, older uh, horde, uh, well, this older you know, horde style. But I do want to see the? Uh, I am excited to take on you know, like the uh, um, structure, you know, you know as uh, the community calls them, uh, the engineering degree uh, zombies. They are very much. Uh, I don't know. Not everyone enjoys them. They kind of prefer the style where they're kind of dumb zombies, which I uh, I can understand. But I think it's kind of nice to have a mixture of the two. Have uh, you know, like some that just run around beating on blocks, and uh, and then uh, have the bunch that just and gives me a uh, yo know, they. 
they path along your stuff and they try to figure it all out. The run a little dry on arrows again. Marla's gone. Can we get one more? No. Ah, well. Not really want to use the sub six twos. Uh, do I got? Do I have any feather? Like any more feathers hanging out in the box? Ten and I really got. Well, I got some steel arrows. I could give to the zombies. Those were looted, I think. One's gone. Two are gone. Last one. Whoever wants it gets it. Curly is looking at it. Tell you what, you gotta send this to you for your have for your troubles. Um fire off one more round into the crowd and then I'll it just uh yeah, I'm, that's the last round I'm using for for this sword, so I'll catch up with you guys in 20 minutes, you know, for you guys to see me uh, clearing up the rest of the crowd um, on dirt, so give me a second. And that is the day bell. We have survived uh, day 21's horde, which is very nice. I just want to make sure, before I forget anything, just... Uh, Grab the old, uh, get the mini by camel bars crafted up. Oh, need some more electrical birds real quick. Grab those, and there we go. Get that crafted up, and, but let's just, uh, jump down here, and, and I'll just time lapse this little horde beating, and, and then, uh, we'll go from there. There's, uh, let's see. And as I'm taking Mikey down, this is... Oh, come on, Mikey. Mikey, come on. There is lots of uh, loot here uh, from bodies. Oh! Got another curly. This block did take a lot of damage here, so. Had to repair that after the rescue mission. Uh, that was coming up next episode, but. I'm gonna leave it here as I'm beating up old curly. So, I thank you guys so much for watching, and. I hope you like and subscribe, and you know, watch some of my other content, and I will see you in the next one. Take care.